Okay, hello everybody. Paul Richards here with PTZ Optics. Looking at the Intel Nook Skull Canyon, this time with two cameras, live streaming and recording and video conferencing. We did a full test. Let me grab my Skull Canyon here. Um, yeah, it, it, this thing has been blowing my mind. Let's unplug it. I even got an SD card in here. I love the SD card reader. You can just throw things in there. Great piece of technology. I'm going to show you here. We did a two camera test. So if you didn't see our last video, we did live streaming 1080p, recording 1080p, brought in a 1080p camera, two monitors, which is the key for the, the next video. We're going to do how to host a live talk show with the Intel Nook Skull Canyon. Let's go ahead and take a look at the benchmark test we did just a few minutes ago. Okay, hello everybody. We're doing our dual camera live streaming 1080p test with the Intel Nook Skull Canyon. Uh, starting off with 34 C uh, CPU utilization, 34%. So if you saw our other videos, you know that um, we're basically testing live streaming in 1080p, recording in 1080p, and we're doing all of this with vMix, as you can see behind me. Currently, I'm recording, so I am recording in 1080p, and the re looks like we're sitting at about 40% utilization of this Intel Nook Skull Canyon. Um, I actually have Jonathan here with me. Um, John, tell me, what is inside this Intel Nook really quickly? It's uh, got 32 gigabytes of RAM, uh, and it's got a 250 giga, uh, gigabyte hard drive. Solid state hard state drive. drive. Yeah. Okay. Jonathan's with me because we're also going to do a video conference call here to really... Oh, we're already... We're video conferencing too. I've already got the Zoom call lined up. Um, so that gets us at 44%. Two cameras. Cam one, cam two. So let's do that real quick. Here's cam two. Woo, 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 woo. 1080p. I'm not seeing any problems, any slowdown. It looks really great. And then... This is my main cam. So I've got two cams there. Uh, in fact, let me do a little, let me just put this other cam up in the corner. Here's two cams at the same time. So two 1080p cameras um, and we're recording in 1080p and that is putting us, us at about 42%. So we haven't started live streaming yet. So, I'm going to go ahead and the other thing I'm going to do is I'm going to enable external. So what that does is that creates a virtual camera um, that I can feed back to Jonathan in the video conference call. That's taking us up to 50%. So the second camera is adding a good 10 or 15% CPU usage. Um, let's go pull up my vMix. Okay, so now I'm going to mute you, John, until I need you because you're typing in the background. Um, I'm gonna start streaming. Okay. Now we are streaming 1080p. We are recording in 1080p. We've got a 1080p external video. Wow. And we're video conferencing. So that means I should be able to, um, I'm gonna pull up a little virtual set here and do a dual channel, uh, stream here so let's do me in one side and we'll pull in the desktop capture on the other all right so now i'm gonna take um jonathan i'm gonna put you full screen again and okay. we're going to look at a video conference call so 1080p live streaming and let's just go ahead and see. So we're, this is like kind of the max test we were gonna run on this baby. Uh, let's just see where the task manager lies. 68, 73%, John. Sorry, I'm covering up your face a little bit. Are you surprised? I am honestly, yeah. I didn't expect that thing to perform that well and this smooth. It's super smooth. Even when we're getting up to 77%, um, we're not seeing any dips. My cameras nope. are good to go. Um, let's actually put this. All right, so <laughs> here's another camera up here. I don't know, maybe I'll put this camera down here or something. So two. 
Okay, so I'm gonna stop the video there. Um, that was it, guys. Two cameras. It does work. Live streaming and recording. You might want to tweak your setup if you're planning to use the Skull Canyon with two 1080p cameras. It does definitely work. It would be great for recording. Recording and streaming is getting you up into the 70-80%, which we don't normally suggest. So I would say maybe don't record or maybe just stream or one or the other. Allow the cloud to stream for you. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for great videos like this. The next video is how to host a live stream how to host a live talk show with the Intel Nook Skull Canyon. Look at this baby. Beautiful, right? See you guys in the next video. Take care.